the right to be forgotten. What does that mean to you? Well, if you hold somebody's personal records, a candidate's for instance, their birth dates or any information that's personal to them, that person can phone you up or email you and ask you to remove all the information. That includes all their email records, all their database records and potentially even any phone records. And you need to do this within 30 days. Because if you don't do this, they can report you to the ICO, the Independent Commission Officer. In the old days, when a candidate or person emails or requests a copy of all their data, you could charge for that information. But now, you have to do it for free. Not only can you not charge for giving this information, the candidate can even ask you to take all that information that you have on file and give it to your competitor. The process you need to have in place is as follows. First thing you need to do is speak to your CRM provider or any other database provider and find out what you need to do to easily delete everything to do with that one personal record belonging to either a customer, a supplier, or even a candidate. The next thing, of course, you want to do is to record this process that you're going to follow. So I recommend you use a product called droplr.com. So it allows you to record all your screen key presses to make this process happen. And then you can save that process in a video instead of having to type long documents out. And then, of course, most importantly, give that video or process to your DPO your data protection officer to build up a list of processes so that when that request comes in, you can just be straight away back to the candidate and say, done, 